Alrighty, hello and welcome to my reaction to the Nintendo Direct Partner Showcase, Nintendo Direct Mini Partner Showcase. Okay, it looks like it's going to be pretty interesting so far. I've seen only one leak, which was the Sparks of Hope, new Sparks of Hope images and DLC confirmation. So let's hop in and see what else is in store here. It's going to be pretty exciting. Got our COVID notification as is standard now. Okay. When mankind is consumed Capcom. by darkness and the land falls into chaos, hmm. the arch demon of the abyss the shall demon. rise from the earth. Sure they come rushing here this in a desperate is, attempt to survive. Country. Or is it monster? Both beast and man have more in common than they think. No, I don't think it's a monster. Oh yes, it is not skipping too. <laughs> DLC. Okay, pretty good. I think. Demo available now, that's nice. I haven't actually played Rise yet. I probably Hello, should. everyone. Welcome to today's Nintendo Direct Mini Partner Showcase. Okay, we're in this presentation. Into it. We'll be focusing on Nintendo Switch games launching this year from our publishing and development partners. Okay, this year. Okay, let's yeah. get into the headlines. So it'll be the far releases from the second and third The party. battle to reclaim Earth begins. The year is 5012 AD. 
Machine life forms have overwhelmed the planet, causing the collapse of civilization and forcing humans to take refuge on the moon. Oh, this sounds fun. Nair. Now, with Nair an Automata. android squad called Yorha, the humans are prepared to stand against these Nair machine life form Switch. invaders. Glory, Certainly a is. battle okay. android 2B and a scanner android 9S are this two key very members of this squad. Machine life forms in conflict with androids. So what will come of this Neo bloodless battle? Switch? This is a Square Enix, so I'm not expecting a card. You just die already! This version of the award-winning Nier Automata comes with previously released content, including additional modes and costumes. Nice. New costumes exclusive to the Nintendo Switch version will also be available at launch. Cool. Reclaim Earth in Nier Automata, the end of Yorha edition, launching on the Nintendo October Switch system 6th. October 6th. Okay. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. That's a very nice development. Maze of Deceptions. Murder Mystery. Ooh, that's fun. Past Memories. Get ready to immerse yourself in surreal riddles and a chilling story in this modern take on puzzle adventure games. Solve the enigma of Lorelei and the Laser Eyes, launching first for consoles on Nintendo Switch next year. Okay, next year, that sounds Familiar faces are making a splash in these games. Bomberman! A new Bomberman game is coming to Nintendo Switch. Hell yeah. This time, a bombastic new mode called Castle Mode enters the fray. A team of up to 15 players must blast their way to treasure oh chests, while one defending player tries to hold them off. Set up your defense wisely to blow away opponents, literally. Oh, you can also create fine. and share your own battle stages. Have a blast when Super Bomberman R2 launches on Nintendo Switch next year. Okay, next year. Ten Mega Man Battle Network games oh, originally released on the Game Boy Advance system oh, are coming yes. to Nintendo Switch. Control Mega Man in grid-based combat yes. and use battle chips to gain devastating abilities. This collection includes a gallery with over 1,000 illustrations and a music mode Is containing one over 150 six? songs from across the series. Like Mega Man Battle Network Legacy Collection launches on Nintendo Switch next year. The full collection will also be digitally available as Volume 1 and Volume 2 each sold separately. A remake of Pac-Man World is coming soon. Okay, Pac-Man World. Pac-Man's family has been kidnapped. To rescue them, he sets off for Ghost Island. Eating dots isn't all you can do here. I might play it. Trounce enemies with pack dots. The rev roll, the butt bounce, and a giant Pac-Man? From high-speed chases to galactic escapades, you'll explore all sorts of zany levels. Save the Pac-Fan in Pac-Man World Repack, launching on Nintendo Switch August 26th. Mm -hmm. Two unlikely friends, one incredible journey. Mm -hmm. A fawn and a wolf cub must work together to find a way home across the snowy wilderness in indie? the handcrafted world of Blanc. Looks like in this game. emotional adventure, these unlikely friends must coordinate and use their individual strengths to solve environmental puzzles and navigate through the frigid wilds. Blanc is a completely text-free story with local and online co-op play, so all players can enjoy it. Online co-op play? Forge an unexpected bond in Blanc. This year? Launching as a console exclusive nope, on year. Nintendo Switch, February 2023. Okay. Arr! 
a swashbuckling adventure returns. Pirating is in my blood, like adrenaline or stale grog. I've been in enough scraps to fill a dozen scrapbooks. I've got stories about ships, fights, love, treasure, betrayal, and root beer. But how about one that has all of the above? My name is Guybrush Threepwood, and this is a story about the time I finally found the the secret of Monkey Island. Guy brush three wood. I'm not entirely sold on this art style of the game, but it is a new Monkey Island game, so that's something. Setups and I'm on the Return to Monkey Island. Sometime this year. Okay. Monkey Around in Return to Monkey Island, launching first for consoles on Nintendo Switch this year. Next. We have some news about a game that was announced last June. Please take a look. Oh, a game from last June. Mario and the Rabbids. Okay, last this is stop Mario for Rabbids. a galactic adventure in the latest Mario plus Rabbids game. Space is in a universe of trouble when otherworldly enemies suddenly appear. Their goal? Take the energy possessed by Sparks, these mysterious creatures. Now, our heroes must set out to save them. A new adventure of epic proportions awaits. You'll initiate a turn-based battle when you encounter an enemy. Before we begin, here's something you ought to know. You can freely move around the battlefield as much as you'd like within your character's range before using their weapon. Pretty neat, huh? Let's start with Mario. Three enemies are in the way, so let's dash into one of them. Now select Rabbit Rosalina and have her dash into another. Next, Rabbit Luigi. One more dash, and now Disruptor time! By using a dash first, then the weapon, three enemies were wiped out. With that, his turn is over. Back to Mario. Let's take out the other two. Pew pew! That concludes his turn. Last but not least, Rabbit Rosalina. Team up with an ally and jump! Get positioned, then finish off with the Kaboomer. Okay, our turn's over. And now, the enemy attacks. Be sure to take cover and you might be safe. If you don't, it won't be pretty. All right, we've got the floor again. Dash toward the bomb, and if you chuck it over, boom! That'll do it. The key to victory is how you assemble your team and navigate around the battlefield. Wait, is that Bowser? And he's joining the team? Mario plus Rabbids Sparks of Hope rockets onto the Nintendo October Switch 20th. system October 20th. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. Check out Ubisoft's special nice. showcase tomorrow for more details about Mario plus Rabbids Sparks okay. of Hope. Ubisoft really showcase. We hope you're looking forward to the chaotic adventures of Mario and the Rabbids. Let's take a look at more headlines. There's something for everyone on Nintendo Switch. During a storm, young alchemist Noah crash lands in ancient ruins. 
The layout of these multi-layered ruins changes every time you enter them. Mm. Recruit allies called Lilliputs to challenge the enemies lurking around every corner. String together combos and perform powerful elemental attacks to defeat foes. Little Noah, Scion of Paradise, launches a Nintendo Switch later today. Okay, today. Cool. All aboard! In the management sim Railgrade, you'll build railway systems to efficiently transport cargo and help restore economic prosperity to an industrial colony. Complete various tasks to prepare each shipment before it's delivered to its destination. Your strategies will change based on various factors, like the number and length of trains to run, which resources to acquire, and how to transport cargo from point A to point B. Railgrade, steamrolls onto Nintendo Switch this fall. Join aspiring game creator Kenta in a hand-drawn adventure to save the world in his latest creation, The Legend of Wright. Taking place in Kenta's notebook, this RPG spans over 200 pages where you must draw, erase, solve puzzles, and even consult your handy calculator. Discover a new way to play every time you turn the page. RPG Time, The Legend of Wright unfolds cool. onto Nintendo Switch August 18th. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. Spin Dash into a new zone. Sonic's latest action adventure kicks off on the vibrant Starfall Islands, home to a mysterious civilization. Here, you can freely dash yeah, through a Sonic vast Frontier. open zone, taking full advantage of Sonic's speedy skills. Lock on and attack enemies standing in your way. Chain together attacks to trigger combos and rack up damage. With good timing, you can even deflect enemy attacks. Acquire skills to bolster Sonic's arsenal of moves. You can also enter a special zone called Cyberspace. Take Cyberspace. on challenges at supersonic speeds and grab keys to progress. What awaits Sonic on these strange islands? Sonic Frontiers dashes onto Nintendo Switch this holiday. Live magically alongside your Disney and Pixar friends. This magical Dreamlight Sunday? Valley was once an idyllic land where Disney and Pixar characters Dreamlight lived Valley. in harmony until the forgetting turned this dream into a nightmare. Now, it's up to you to help these iconic residents recover their lost memories and reveal the secrets that led you here. Bring the magic back to Dreamlight Valley in this mesmerizing life simulation adventure. Explore this land's many diverse realms and forge lasting huh? friendships with heroes and villains alike. Really much, like, oh. Everyone you meet will have personal magical stories to discover three. and adventures to complete. Help them out by exploring, giving them gifts, and performing other fun activities. Mm. In this world, you can be whoever you I dream yourself to be. Disney, Disney Dreamlight Valley launches on Nintendo Switch September different. 6th as an early access title. Take these adventures with you on the go. Live Alive is coming alive on July 22nd. Multiple stories great. featuring different protagonists, time periods, and gameplay await. Now in HD 2D. A demo with the start of three chapters, Imperial China, Twilight of Edo Japan, and The Distant Future will be available on Nintendo eShop later today. Okay, Save data from the demo can be transferred to the full game once purchased. Nice. Doraemon, Nobi, and their friends land on an unknown planet and decide to help a new friend fulfill his dreams by farming, plow yeah, the fields, harvest crops, and tend to the animals. You can even use Doraemon's secret gadgets to farm in a flash. Relax by living with friends eating delicious meals, and fishing. And with local play, nice you and a pal can build a ranch together. 
Doraemon Story of Seasons Friends of the Great Kingdom launches on the Nintendo Switch system this year. The world of Minecraft meets action strategy gameplay in Minecraft Legends. A beautiful land surrounded by rich nature is invaded by enemies from another dimension. Team up with allies and fight against this monstrous force threatening the world. What secrets await in this new yet familiar universe? Minecraft Legends launches on Nintendo Switch next year. It's a treasure hunter's paradise. Two siblings dream of collecting grand treasures from around the world. Venture to the realm of Draconia to become legendary treasure hunters. In this Dragon Quest series spin-off, you'll recruit a variety of well-mannered monsters to join you on a marvelous adventure. With their help, and with your trusty fortune finder, locating loot will be a breeze. Monsters are perfect travel buddies for exploring this vast world. Bounce on a slime to reach high ledges, or dangle from a drachy to glide over gaping chasms. Support your monsters in battle as they fearlessly fend off foes. Bring your hard-earned haul back to your base and see how much it's worth. Collect more riches to expand your base and increase your treasure hunting level. X marks the spot when Dragon Quest Treasures launches on Nintendo Switch December, December 9th. 9th. <laughs> so much fun together. At first, your participation is appreciated and required. There might even be cake. Is portal the portal the companion switch? collection will be available thing. later today. Yeah, okay. I yeah. wanted to call it the why do you keep exactly. killing me collection, but oh well. Let's get started, you monster. Okay, today... Some good things to do with Farm, fight, and forge friendships in a new fantasy world. Welcome to Lethe, a peaceful village where seasons brightly color the environment. Your story begins here in this brand new huh. life simulation RPG. This Square Enix trying to do, do a little farm seasons. work. Cooking or craft items. Be, be and trek through the fields to collect materials. all while meeting townsfolk along the way. The seasons gently flow yep. from spring, is doing summer, fall, <laughs> and winter. However, they will give way to the season of death. Quietus. Crops wither. Life is threatened. Find a way to stop the season of death from wreaking havoc on your home. The fate of the village depends on you. Begin your new life in Harvestella, November launching 4th, on Nintendo okay. Switch November 4th. You pick that up. See what it's all about. This next segment will be our last announcement. Please take a look. Okay, here's the last announcement. Mission start! It's Persona 5, isn't it? Yeah! After all these Coming years, finally. 
Dawn Morgana, reigning ace of the Phantom Thieves of Hearts. And today, I'm bringing along an ultra top secret video. I hope first. you're ready. Yup, Persona 5 Royal will launch on Nintendo Switch October 21st. People are expecting That's this, not all. So. Let's keep the ball rolling, huh, Teddy? <laughs> right on! Nice Teddy. baton pass, Morgana! Okay, everyone, check this out! Uh -oh. Persona 4 Golden. Better bear leave it! Persona 4 Golden and Persona 3 Portable are also Persona coming! Persona 3 Portable? Okay. Keep your eyes peeled five. for more Persona! On Nintendo Switch! That's all for That's today's Nintendo to Direct it. Mini Partner Showcase. Thank you for watching. Yeah, so this is pretty solid direct. This will probably be all the third party and second party announcements that would happen during in a full on E3 direct, so looks pretty solid. Yep, that's a very nice. Solid Direct. It was a partner, a mini partner showcase, so obviously it wouldn't be like a full on 40 minutes to an hour long Direct that announces everything in store. But for what it is, it's really strong announcements that were expected did come like the Persona games. So things that weren't quite on, I at least I didn't see floating around as predictions was Nair Automata coming to the Switch, though that has been something that people have wanted for a long time. So that's good. One thing that I, I'm surprised I didn't see anything on was where the hell is Advance Wars? Is, is that coming out still? It should be, but I haven't seen anything in terms of an announcement. Has it been pushed back entirely into 2023? Are we looking at the game coming out a whole year after when it was supposed to? Or it was, I believe the game was completed, so it has to come out at some point. There's no way they're putting a game that was fully completed on the shelf and never releasing it. So that's something I would have liked to see, just confirmation of when it's coming out. And I guess from here on out will be the wait for the wait for if there will be a Nintendo Nintendo Direct. I'm thinking that mm, if there isn't one in July, then there'll probably be a big September Direct. So that will probably be the next big direct on deck. Unless the Pokemon company decides to do a direct, which they very well may. Something between the summer and the fall when the game actually releases. So there might be a Pokemon direct sometime in the near future. But yeah, I think this, uh, this, was, this was a very good direct. Nice middle ground direct, something to whet everyone's game appetites and give them an idea of what will be coming out this year from Nintendo's various partners. And that clears the slate for a Nintendo a Nintendo centric Nintendo Direct sometime in the future, which is good. So thanks for watching. And I will see you all next time.
Goodbye.